what is happening what is going on you absolute bunch of legends so i'm going to show you how to, in this video how to create a procedural frosted glass material in blender let's get into it it's really easy to do so first thing we're going to need is an object so i'm going to use the monkey so go shift a mesh and we're going to get monkey then i'm going to click here and i'm just going to add a subdivision surface modifier so over there bring this to two right click shade smooth yes yeah, so i'm going to scale it up camera delete it don't need it and then select your object go to shading and then hit new and just zoom in like this go to your rendered view click there and do that and then first thing you want to do is you want to change your rqr 1.45 which is glass and bring your roughness down to about there then transmission bring it up and bring this all the way up click on your coat change this to 0 0.25 and then bring in the roughness all the way up to about there and then you want to change your rqr to 1.45 so it matches your rqr over there okay then first thing you want to go now is go shift a and look for a hue saturation value node put this there plug the color into the base color boom then shift a and look for a color ramp put this there and then plug this color into the color of your color ramp and then i'm going to bring the saturation down to about 0 0.7 and there we go that is literally your, your material it's pretty much that easy and then you can always just adjust your you can see if you bring it in it crushes it if you bring the white in gives it a bit more of a reflection so you can play around with that until you find something that you like but i think this looks pretty good and you can see how it will work in different kind of scenes so you can see here if i bring in another hdri it will change the way your frosted glass will look so you can see there change it like that but it looks pretty good something created pretty easily in blender so hopefully you enjoyed the video make sure you hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video peace